Hi everyone. Today I'll show you how numbers work in Python, and I'll also show you how to solve simple and intermediate math problems using Python. I will also demonstrate the difference between integer and floating numbers. In Python, there are three types of numbers, integer, floating, and complex numbers. Today, we will be talking about integer and floating numbers, since these are more commonly used in beginner programs. Integer numbers in Python are pretty self-explanatory, as they are any positive or negative whole numbers. Floating numbers, on the other hand, are any decimal or fractional numbers. When you use a number in a Python program, you do not need to use quotation marks as numbers are already defined. Now let's do a simple math problem in Python using the arithmetic operators. In the Python shell, if you type print 5 plus 5 and then press enter, the output is 10. If you type print 10 minus 5 and then press enter, the output is 5. Now let's do some multiplication and division. In the Python shell, if you type print 5 and then the star symbol, which you do shift 8 and then a 5 again, and then you press enter, the output is 25. This is an example of a simple multiplication problem in Python. To do division, you can type print 10, and then the forward slash, and 2, and the output is 5. The cool thing about Python is that all of the operators can be used with any number no matter the size. Now let's do some higher level math problems. To do multi-step math problems in Python, you use the order of operations. For example, if you type print, then a set of parentheses, and then in that, 7 minus 5, then a multiplication sign, then another set of parentheses, and then 6 divided by 2, the output is 6. To use exponents in Python, you simply type the multiplication sign two times. For example, if you type print 5, then the multiplication sign two times, then 2, and then press enter, the output is 25. Floor division in Python is used to only output the whole number value, not the decimal value. For example, if you type print 10 divided by 3, then the output is 3.3 repeating. But if you type print 10 and then double forward slash 3, the output is just 3 with no decimals. Finally, in the arithmetic operator category, there is modulus. The modulus operator displays the remainder in a division problem. If you type print 5, then the percent sign, 2, then the output is 1. This is because the remainder is 1. If you type print 4, percent sign, 2, and then press enter, the output is 0 because the remainder is 0. Those are all of the arithmetic operators in Python. Now let's move on to the relational operators. These operators describe the relation between two or more numbers by replying with either true or false. If you type print 5 greater than symbol 2 and then press enter, the output is true. This is because 5 is greater than 2. If you type print 10 is less than 7 and then press enter, the output is false. This is because 10 is not less than 7. These operators also include greater than equal to and less than equal to. Now that you know how arithmetic and relational operators work in Python, you can explore and learn many new programs. Thanks for watching. Bye.